think we got a buyer for Diaz's no merchandise. Way. Gotta give him a ring, man. Set up the deal, you know? Where are you now? You okay, Leo? He's now kinda different. Just tell me where you are. Who the hell is this? Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. Oh, it's so hot outside today. Welcome back everyone. This is our third videotape here in Vice City. And we've just exchanged our nightstick for a more manly weapon, this baseball bat. And we're also going to pick up this uh, metal for our fist. It's... I don't know what it's called, but it's a fisting aid, if you will. And... Um, I'm happy to see that picking up uh, that cellular phone this morning has paid off because now we know that the chef's name was Leo and hopefully we will get some more uh, leads from his contacts in the following hours and days. Now we're in the parking lot looking for a nice car and we've also met uh, another guy uh, this morning, uh, the guy driving the uh, white inferno and he helped us out, he gave us a gun. Uh, but I'm sure that Tommy could have handled uh, the situation just as easily without his help, right, Tommy? Yeah. Exactly. Now, the guy with the white and furnace is uh, also somehow connected to this um, uh, situation with our stolen cash. But right now, we're going to perform our first unique stunt in a car and also probably the most dangerous one because we're jumping from rooftop to rooftop insanity on a videotape just like this guys look unique stunt six hundred dollars yes <laughs> and what a great landing from tommy oh yeah <laughs> when is the last time you've seen someone jump with a car from rooftop to rooftop in your city guys that's right never because well, this is Vice City. This is where the action is at. And now, we're going to uh, speak to uh, Ken, our lawyer, give him a little status update on our situation, see if he has any new ideas or plans. And uh, then, if we have enough time later on, we might just perform some more unique stunts. Right now, though, let's go in. Boom! <laughs> oh, for God's sake, it's you! Oh, jeez! I'm gonna need new pants! Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon. Now, where is the goddamn money? Relax, relax. We're not relax, oh, don't do it when you wanna really get did. to it. And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor! You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. I believe now you. look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out! I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about no, it. No, 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 no! I tried that! The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. Get out of the way! Told ya! Dumb Florida moron. A hammer, huh? Okay, so we have to intimidate two jurors, but we can only injure them, which is just fine in my opinion. Look, tell me, your, your car has no doors. <laughs> yeah, let's check out our map, actually. Uh, okay, so the first one is really close. I think we're going in the r the right direction. Yeah. All right. So this is the way. Ah, here it is. This is the way that things are done here in uh, Vice City. Hello over there. Is this your car? Look. Check it out. Check what we're doing to it. Look, Mr. Juror, how much did you pay for it? $5,000? Your brand new shining car? Look, do you like this? Check it out. Oh man, he's not even flinching. 
I guess that he must really like that girl, or maybe he just uh, doesn't want his wife to find out because, you know, if he creates a commotion here, then it would end up in the newspapers and she could read it and things like that. So, hmm, let's try something else to take him from behind. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> Get up. Get up. Yeah. Uh oh. No, you don't. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we can smash cars up by using hammers or similar weapons, such as the baseball bat. Get out. Oh, we have a smart one, do we? He's locked himself in. Well, this gives me an idea, guys. Let's try to ask for the VCPD's help and also use our new little... Fisty, uh, metal. Come on, officer. This way. We need some help getting a, a, a really bad guy out of the car. Come on. Uh-oh, more policemen. I am an officer of the law. Ah, <laughs> uh, no. Okay, this is perfect. Shoot at the juror. Yeah, shoot him. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Shoot! This is just like training. Giorgio sends his regards. I'll get him down. This was awesome, guys. Did you see that? He was actually shooting at the juror. Oh man. Hello. This must be um, the juror's mistress. Yeah. Sure looks like her. Okay. Let's uh, see if we can uh, grab a car and. Yeah, this is the perfect car. And get to the next juror just as uh, the neon lights are starting to uh, appear here at the hotels near the beach. And, uh,. Oh, we need some armor, guys. So let's just stop at uh, the Standing Hotel. Pick up a nice, uh, shiny new sample. Because, yeah, they're still handing out armor samples at the parking lot. And we really needed this after the number that uh, the policeman uh, pulled on us. Hold on. Oh, oh, I see. Well now, smash up the juror's car. Hold on, I have a, I have a sneaky idea. We're gonna park right next to his car. And then, we're gonna, we're gonna do this to our car. We're gonna destroy it. It's gonna hopefully blow up right next to the juror's car. <laughs> yeah, Tommy boy. Just gotta make sure that we don't actually damage his car. Let's uh, use some of the ammo which we got from uh, that guy in the white and furnace. Yeah. Shoot that car. Oh, run, 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 run. Check it out. is a dirty word awesome you guys mission passed four hundred dollars and somehow the juror's car is still running it's still intact hmm well let's leave it there we could pick it up but uh, it's best to leave it there as a reminder of what could happen if he messes with uh oh if he messes with uh with us. Hey Tommy, it's Sonny. How's the suntan? I ain't got no suntan. We ain't got my money either, so I'm one of them myself. What are you doing? So tell me, Tommy, what are you doing? I'm looking for the money, Sonny. Don't worry. I am worrying, Tommy. That's my style, because I seem to have this problem in my life with unreliable people. Don't be an unreliable person, Tommy, please. Do us both a favor. I'm 
How did that guy get our phone number and so quick? I I don't like this. Maybe he got it from the guy who tried to call Leo. Maybe they're all in cahoots. Who knows? But right now we're going to uh, perform some more unique stunts and then call it a night. Let's see. Where is our nice little bike? Our PCJ 600 right over there. Ah. No time to answer phone calls. Okay. Okay. Check it out! Midnight bike jumping on top of various $700 for our seventh unique stunt. Oh yeah, it's midnight, guys. And there are still some stunts left to perform, such as this one. Oh yeah! <laughs> Go, Tommy! $800 and uh, Tommy didn't even fall this time. Which is, uh, of course, uh, just great. Now, let's see. Any more places to uh, get some stunts done here? Uh, actually, I know a perfect place. Oh, a criminal was running. Here, see these staircases? Let's just uh, get into a nice position. And go, 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 Tommy boy, go! Yes! Yes! Tommy really likes his rooftops to tops today, right guys? $900 and check it out. We already have $6,000. Oh my god. Someone left. Someone left grenades outside of the police station. Just lying around. Some, who knows, some rookie cop just... Uh, whoops, I lost my grenades. Or maybe they were trying to... Um, uh, they were trying to, uh, uh, you know, uh, put the grenades in the evidence locker and for some reason they misplaced them or something. Whatever the case, this has been uh, an eventful day. So right now it's time to get some, uh, some much needed shut eye. What do you say, Tommy? Yeah. All right, back at the hotel with $6,000 in our pockets. And uh, we're gonna answer the phone call later. In the morning, actually. Right now, we're going to uh, check into our room as soon as the receptionist is back. And then we shall uh, be right back with you in the morning. Hmm, elevators. Good night.